Hello everybody. All right, so today what we're going to do is create a new world for the hardcore flatland or not flatland large biome challenge. And of course, since it's hardcore, there's no bonus chest. So, here we go. Yeah, I'm going to put a 1 there because I'll probably end up doing this a few times to start in a variety of different uh, biomes. Okay, so let's see where we go. So there's a couple of rules. Um, first off, I'm going to try to do this vegetarian. So not that I personally am a vegetarian, but we're just going with it that way. So no killing pigs, sheep, chicken, or cows. Spiders, sure, they're hostile, whatever, I gotta defend myself. And I'm spawning under the sea. Interesting. Well, I don't think that uh, chickens are gonna be much of an issue because it looks like I might be in, what do we got here? An ocean biome. Yep. All right. Well, I might end up having to survive on zombie meat. Things get really bad. But let's take down this and let's see if we can get an apple at least. So. a bit of lag. Yeah, we got a bit of lag. And this is on single player. This is with the uh, brand new snapshot that came out today. So week 25. 25 or 26, I can't remember. Wow, it's a lot of lag. And I hear skeletons somewhere. So that could actually be encouraging, since with no uh, no chickens, maybe I've got a skeleton spawner, which would be helpful. Okay, so that is hopefully all of that. Oh, I've got three trees here, four trees. Let's take a look around while that despawns a bit. saplings coming down. I'm going to be needing seeds. I can see that already. So that's one of the things that I'm looking for and not having much luck with actually. So, a nice little collection of islands. Wow, I still haven't gotten any seeds. One. <laughs> I might be going after those skeletons just to get some bone meal. Aha. That's interesting. Okay. A block of iron. Okay, good. That might end up being my first shelter. All right, so this is our first island. Let's go back and see what goodies we got.
Aha. Uh -huh. I didn't have to go far. I just walked all around it. But before I go in, let's uh, take care of this. So, there's a couple things that I need to do. Since I'm in an ocean biome, food is going to be very scarce. But that means I am going to need a hoe. I'm also going to need a pick. And since I hear a skeleton down there, I'm going to definitely need a sword. And I'm going to stop there, uh, just because, realistically, I'll probably be able to get some stone to make better tools, so it might be a bit of overkill. Interesting how much more lag is going on, though. Okay, so... Before I carry on too much further here, there's another seed. Okay, good. So, right here will be my garden. I got six. Alright. I'll have that start. And I'll see how well I do here. There he is. Oh, shoot. Well, I got bone meal. <laughs> And just like that, I'm already hurt. And he was the only skeleton, so my dreams of a spawner, not realized. All right, well, luckily that happened while I still had some health, so, or some food, some, so I'm still healing is what I'm getting, trying to say. Okay, hey, why don't we get down here? Something more extensive. Okay. Let's start by getting some stone. Taking care of our skeleton problem. At least we got some bones out of them. This is probably not the best way to go about it, but that's all right. There's iron there too. Okay, let's go back to my workbench. Now, this will let me get the iron. This will do better. While I'm here, I will also make sure I make a uh, furnace simply because I know I'm going to need it. Um, so let's get that iron. iron on the other little cave that I saw, right? So, oh, and I know that there's stuff down there too. Not 
Doing well on the seeds. Okay, let's see if we can get in here safely. I think I like this place better. It's just a little not so not easily blocked off, I guess. But for now, let's go back over to the other place. Let's see what we can do. I just lost another hunger bar. Increase this a bit. And we got one more seed. You know what? I'm not going to find wolves. All right, so that gives me, uh, let's take you. Crap. All right. Night's falling, so I've got to defend myself. What I'm doing now is hoping to grab just a little bit of wood prior to monsters spawning. Uh, my plan is to, hmm, what is my plan? Get underground, hide myself. Take that. Okay. I've got dirt blocks and I've got stone blocks. So for today, there, I can then see when it's nay. All right, so yeah, okay for wood. So let's start with burning that. Um, well, that's going on. Let's put down a workbench. Oh, sh! Oh, good, I got one. I thought I had lost it. All right. So I need to have torches. Uh, and I'll use sticks to burn. Okay, here they come. So, first off, let's light up my area just a little. That's probably good enough. All right, I can probably get rid of that too. So, this is my first night. Uh, I now have three charcoal. Uh, let's make up some of that. At least one of those for torches. That's got, oh, move bread. Bread. 
All right, I'm going to save that. I may end up needing it. That's pretty much all I need to do at the moment. So once, oh, okay, right. Uh, let's do that. I think I'd rather use that on torches. I can get lots of wood. What else do I need? All right. Speaking of wood, let's make an axe. And let's start to organize my bar a little bit. I'm only going to need that there. Have I got any leftover wood? I will. Shovel for gravel. Okay. Uh, ultimately, I'll need another pick, I'm sure. Okay, so my iron is taken care of. Oh, I messed that up. This is in case I get something I need. And just because I can. So with seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two, three, I could make pants. Or I can make a bucket, which might be handy. And then I'll make, yeah, I'll make the boots. Look at that, the shiny boots. Okay, so at this point, I hear somebody, but I'm okay for my first night. So I'm just going to hang it out and uh, call it a day. So I'll, let's see, this is what I got after my first day. Um, thanks to that skeleton, I've actually got a bit of a head start on my food production. Uh, now I've got some torches that I can place down around my crop so that they can be growing through the night too. Um, so overall, not a bad first outing. All right, I'm going to cut it here.